Okay, yesterday the 8th we went to visit the house. Those are full of diapers. Uh, so anyway, we're going to go through the still pictures so you know what you're looking at. Of course the grass is foot and a half, two feet high. One of Nikki's rugs just thrown out. Uh, they actually were going to try to get rid of some trash, but yeah, they didn't get anywhere with that. Just shit thrown all over the place. Uh, more shit thrown all over the place. More shit thrown all over the place. Two feet tall grass, more shit in the grass. There's something down there, trash, I don't know what. More trash. Burn barrels with piss bottles all over the place. Yes, piss bottles. More. The hole in the pavilion where Keith let the insurance lapse. Said he would take care of it. Nice job, Keith. Been, what, year and a half? Way to take care of it. Good job, bud. Yeah, excellent. The grill is actually still there, although the umbrella over on the side is broken. They stole the chairs, but not the table. I don't know why. Some of their go phone refills. Yay, just throw your shit down. Pool table, I was shocked, is still there. Of course, he's got, Keith has been caught trying to sell it so many times online. It's not even funny. Fucking thief. And broken pool sticks. I don't give a shit. Hey, nice table. <clears throat> yeah, the police don't seem to care. This shit left all, just leave shit all over the place. Doesn't matter. Door's been open for two years. More shit. Oh, these are Keith's buckets. They're full of cat shit. Just leave that. Probably human waste too, since the toilets weren't fucking working. Just yank something off the wall, don't worry about what damage it does. No blinds on any windows. I'm sure something's broken in that picture, but I can't remember what. Oh, hole in the wall, the door, no big deal. Just leave shit all over the place. Bus windows, lights, doesn't matter, just leave it. Uh, Nikki wanted broken something. Not a good picture. Something's, something's broken there. And it just shit all over the place. Actually, this room. Oh, thought it was a clean one. Sorry, guess not. Shit all over the place. There's actually still some dirty diapers in there. Great. This is the shit in the toilet. Yep. Because the water lines broke. And because they didn't have any oil to heat the house. More shit just thrown. Just throw shit all over. Oh, uh, wait till you see the inside of this toilet. Don't get sick. Yep. Just shit in it and don't worry about it. Leave that shit in there. Great. Nice place, eh? Yeah, that's broken. There's the water jugs that they were filling to try to flush the toilet when the water went out. They stole the thermostat. What pieces of shit. Yeah, this is how the living room looks. Nice furniture, real nice fireplace, shit all over the place, literally. Broken stuff all over the place. Just break shit. Look at this room, great. Police don't do anything, the police just <laughs> come out and say, oh well, he claimed this. Well, I think we might be dealing with the police. I think they're going to be doing a little bit better now. Oh, look at that. Just leave the crap all over. Oh, nice. Real clean. Not sure what type of shit I was taking a picture of there. More shit. More shit. Throw shit. Leave shit. Doesn't matter. So all these pictures were taken uh, 
Friday the 8th. May 8th. Ah, this room was actually clean, halfway clean. There's only a little bit of shit on the floor. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Of course, Keith's personal stuff, which is still sitting out there, even though he said he vacated the property by his lawyer. I guess he doesn't want any of this shit, so I don't know what we'll do with it. I'm sure when the time comes, I'll figure out something. Just more crap, crappy place. Was a gorgeous house three years ago. Now it's a piece of shit. Uh, when we were there in October of last year, the house needed about $25,000 worth of work. About half of that attributed directly to Keith. Today, it needs 35, 40, maybe higher than that. I don't know, there's so much shit. This is the great pool. Look at this pool. Isn't that nice? I got some pictures of this pool over the summer, crystal clear, actually swimming in it. Yeah, he thought he shouldn't have to winterize it. So, anyway, this is what uh, Keith has done to a property that he claims is half his, that, but anybody with any brain knows he paid nothing for it was supposed to sign it back over from his to his mom and he didn't do it so great let's just throw shit piss where we want to crap where we want to no heat no water who cares they just throw Nikki's mail don't try to get it to her even though they lived in her place paying nothing except for one year's uh, taxes in three freaking years. That's what uh, Mr. Keith Shulman has actually done and then stole from her.